the Boston Celtics two years in a row in the playoffs, so there is a rivalry, and that rivalry, well, it was stepped up a notch when this man, Ray Allen, moved from the mid in green down to Miami. That's him checking into the game. This is his first shot, played the way along the baseline, and we know he can shoot. 7 of 17 from the floor, Miami up 22-20. Second quarter winding down, Paul Pierce driving to the basket and made it in. 6 of 16 from the field. We were tied at the half, 45 piece into the third. LeBron alley to to D-Wade for the jam. Wade at 17 points on the game. The beat again on the break. This time it's Dwayne Wade finding LeBron James. Similar result, 14-31. From the field for LeBron, Miami up by one. Later, KG, look at that, young KG driving around. And making that one, he had a double up 24 points, 11 rebounds, and it's Jeff Green. How is that? Jeff Green bringing it home. He had 11 points on the game. Boston up by three. Later in the fourth. Speaking of three, number 34, four of three, and you know it's going down. Ray Allen throws the at 21. Miami up by a single. Then Jason Terry knocking down a jumper. He's the bench scorer this year for Boston. The Celtics with a one-point lead, 79-78. LeBron James using his strength and is fading away. 34 points, 16 rebounds, 7 6 Now the game tied at 81, just over two to go. Paul Pierce spins in the lane and hits the tough short jumper. Boston goes up by two, 83-81. Then it's Pierce to KG just inside the three-point line. Pierce. Had a triple double, gets the assist there. Boston up 85 81. Calling a Celtics turnover. Miami down by four. Ray Allen cuts it down to one. 25 seconds to go in the game later. Ray Allen with Miami down by three. Misses the three. LeBron James tracks it down. 12 seconds, 11 seconds, 10 seconds, 9 seconds. LeBron for three. And you know who I use the MVP. He drills the triple. Now Jason Terry for the win. And it doesn't go down, so the game goes into overtime, and in the overtime, the Ray driving and enjoying. Push shot goes straight, there's LeBron James, with one of the season high, 16 rebound, put it back, Miami by four, Kevin Garnett, and the Celtics just won't quit. That jumper ties it at 93. Now, time winding down, Miami turns to D-Ray, just a shot, not really good, on back to the middle. Going to double overtime at the second overtime. You see, there's the John Ronda coming out. If you haven't heard the news, we found out he scored his ACL. He is done for the year. More on that on NBA.com. Later, LeBron James, hoop and bomb at the rack. He made the free throw. The Heat up 98 95. But again, the Celtics staying with it. Jason Terry driving to the rack for the layup. He gets it. It's a one point game. Now it's a one point Boston advantage after Paul Pierce. It's the jump with 30 seconds to go, five seconds remaining in the game. You go to LeBron, no, you go to D-Wade, no, they go to Shane Battier. Battier cannot deliver, and Rondo falls the Celtics without him in the lineup. You're going to be saying that a lot to the rest of you. No Rondo, but the Celtics get the W by two in double OT. Final score, 100 to 98.